Hello dear friends, welcome to Shiksha Mantra and today we are going to discuss something that will be very much helpful for your online classes. Yes dear friends, in this pandemic condition we are actually in a very difficult situation. We are suffering because we can't go to school, we can't enjoy our classrooms, we can't have our tuition classes. So we, the teachers, as well as the students, are forced to stay in jail and follow the online classes. And with the online classes, it needs other skills. Yes, dear friends, besides your skills in mathematics, your skills in language, it also needs your skills in software, in handling mobile phone, in handling several apps. So what happens here, sometimes you have to send your documents to your teachers and from the parts of the teachers, they also have to send some documents to their students, uh, notes or question papers, etc, etc. And these must be sent as PDF. Now it's very difficult whenever you have to send some PDF, what you do? You start searching them in Play Store or in iOS, whatever it may be. And from there, you download them and then you uh, start scanning them and convert them into PDF. But you don't know, you uh, can't stay sure whether these uh, apps are 100% safe and secure to use. And most of the time, they demand you money. You have to buy them to use the features. But here, I'll talk about uh, an app. That app is very easy and it's uh, almost in each and every mobile phones you'll find it and it's really easy to convert them into documents pdf documents and more than that what is most important is 100 percent safe and secure yes dear friends i'm talking of wps office and the scanner in wps office as you know it's also a paid app but with WPS Office, you can use the most uh, features without uh, even paying for it. And uh, actually, uh, those features are really useful. You can uh, create uh, PDF documents with WPS Office very easily. Now I'll show you how it works and what are the features. So left shaped to my mobile screen, I'll have a... So we have done this. Now we have actually the same process uh, must be followed. And uh, here we have two pages uh, here in our credit to convert them into, yes, to convert them into docs, obviously in PDF. Now use done. So what will happen? I will get a list of things. Uh, that are here now I need these two pages only so what I'll do I select these two pages first this one and the second this one now splice with splicing images you can have a preview how it looks in your final presentation you can find out that here we have two pages now it's time for us to export it to PDF if we have exported it to PDF, we get the chance uh, where uh, we want to uh, actually put them. Here I'm putting it into my documents, PDF, WPS Office dot PDF. Here you can uh, rename it. Here I am uh, uh, giving it a name, test one, save. So I've saved it and now it's uh, saved in the documents in the PDF format, okay? So finally, you have your PDF ready to be sent to your teacher or to be sent to your students. It's that very simple with WPS Office. Uh, you can have a look at it. Yes, this is the PDF. Obviously, uh, you may convert it into black and white as well, but I haven't done it. Uh, you may use your tools uh, for PDF editing, etc, etc. You can edit your PDF as well. You have several options here. But this one is when you have uh, snapped uh, pictures with your scanner. Now you want to create a 
PDF uh, that is uh, from your saved pictures from your gallery. So here you would have to uh, open the WPS office and then select import. And with import, your gallery will open and from there you will find the images that are already there saved in your device and uh, from these images you have to select the images you want to convert suppose uh, i have selected the pages of these books now press ok you may have a preview of this as well so i have selected them and uh, now these are here in my gallery so here i'll select them once again then splice so with splicing uh, we obviously get a view of uh, what we have here to be export as picture as images or as PDF so here we are exporting it as PDF so again do the same things you have to repeat what you have done there uh, the other one for test one so we have already had one that is named test one so here will rename it as test 2 and now save it it will get saved to your documents here we have it our PDF now you uh, are ready to send it to your teachers or to your students isn't it very simple yes dear friends it's really very simple follow it and you'll find it effective as well so we are meeting very soon. Till then, bye-bye. Happy learning.